Alan Carr, 46, has recounted his recent conversation about life after death with Paul O'Grady in the wake of his death. The comedian took to Instagram to pen a lengthy tribute to his late friend in view of his one. 1 million followers. He uploaded a picture of himself alongside the comedy veteran using chips as cigarettes, as he penned a lengthy statement reflecting on their friendship. Alan looked back on Paul's anecdotes that would have been literally in hysterics as he admitted he will be missed so much. He also recounted how the pair quipped about life after death and Paul's response after being asked whether he believed he would go to heaven. Alan wrote, I've been no use to anyone today. Loved Paul, who didn't. A true one-off. Having dinner with Paul O'Grady was the closest any of us would get to having dinner with Dorothy Parker or Truman Capote, he would have you literally in hysterics regaling these showbiz anecdotes and quips from Marlene Dietrich to Scylla Black to the Royals to the Disappointer sisters, it seemed like he knew everyone. Alan went on, you will be missed so much, my friend asked him recently do you think you'll go to heaven Paul? Quick as a whip he replied I hope not, I won't know anyone. You legend. The royal family paid homage to the late TV star and the waggy tailed memories he provided for the royals. The official Twitter account wrote, deeply saddened to hear of the death of Paul O'Grady who worked closely with Her Majesty in support of at Battersea underscore, providing lots of laughter and many waggy-tailed memories. Don't miss. Paul O'Grady's tearful words prior to his death amid health struggles, latest, Paul O'Grady's pal saw him full of life at home just before death, update, Paul O'Grady's heartbreaking farewell in last social post before death, obituary. Paul previously described the Queen Consort as, a lovely lady who's passionate about dogs. He said of filming the show, there was a competition to see whose dog would run straight to their owner ignoring the food, squeaky toys etc put in their way. The Duchess's dog ran straight to her, ignoring the temptation put in her way whilst Sausage headed straight for the press and photographers not a bit interested in the competition. Paul's husband Andre Portasio said in a statement this morning, It is with great sadness that I inform you that Paul has passed away unexpectedly but peacefully yesterday evening. We ask, at this difficult time, that whilst you celebrate his life you also respect our privacy as we came to terms with this loss.